So here are signs and symptoms of left side CHF, left side heart failure. So first we have our respiratory distress. So as difficulty breathing when lying flat. Folks, you will be called multiple times throughout your career. More times you can count. For someone that has heart failure, that has literally woken them up out of their sleep. That is something that we think about, right? They're laying flat. Someone can't breathe and they're laying flat. We want to sit them up so they can breathe better. First thing before we do anything, sit them up, okay? Foamy pink tinged sputum. This is big on exams. Pink tinged sputum. What's that from? From blood. So that foamy pink tinged sputum with cough, think CHF. Episodes of difficulty breathing while sleeping that it wakes the patient. I just talked to you about that. Abnormal vital signs. So we talk about blood pressure. That's blood pressure is possibly on the higher side, okay? The heart rate increases to compensate for a decreased stroke volume. It may be regular if dysrhythmia is present. And also an increased breathing rate. What's our patient gonna look like in CHF? Well, what they're gonna look like is high blood pressure, high heart rate, low SpO2, and increased respiration initially. Now looking over some more here, JVD. JVD is a big pearl, why? Blood backs up, right side we get JVD, okay, JVD. Indicates they may also have right-sided heart failure. That's what we're talking about, okay? You see, remember, this is all left-sided. But if we have left-sided, it can lead to the right. Pearl on lung sounds. What's the big pearl on lung sounds? Rails, also called crackles, bilaterally. That is your clear-cut CHF. Rails, bilaterally. That is the most common presentation you'll hear on for exam.